do, Murray, all right? Yeah, you just, when you want to set I'm nervous, them, just... Murray. I'm nervous, brother. Please. Flip the bail and send breathe? it. Right now. Oh my god, it is slippery. What is up guys? Welcome back to another exciting episode of Fishing More Outdoors. If you guys seen last episode, uh, you know we are out here fishing Wisconsin right now, fishing for bluegill and crappies and jumbos and some big pike. Uh, last video I caught a really nice pike. Uh, and I'm out here with the squad. I'm out here with uh, Sobi, Maverick, uh, Eric Hadia, and then one of Eric's buddies. I'm so sorry, I forgot his name already. I'm terrible with names. But yeah, we're just out here living it up, catching some fish. Eric's, this is Eric's day off, so he just wanted to come out here and do some fun fishing. And we're gonna cook some food and catch some fish and hopefully get a bunch of tip-ups set up. We, we have about 10 tip-ups, so. Shut up! So stay tuned. This should be a really fun episode. Alright dudes, in case you guys are wondering, today I'm going to be using uh, my little Sobe Sizzle. This is a ultralight 28 inch. This thing is just perfect for, for all, all types of panfish. And for my jig, I'm just using a little 4 millimeter jig with, uh, with some spikes sitting on there. But enough small talk, let's uh, get to fishing and let's get to catching. Got him. This is a good one. Oh yeah. That is a decent little bluegill, nothing crazy. Hopefully we will catch a lot bigger in this video, but that's a really good start. I'm gonna get him back, get right back down there. Hopefully catch some more. All right, I'm working a, a whole bunch of fish in this hole, but they're just not biting. I'm gonna move on. Oh yeah, this is a big fish. Got him, biggin', biggin'. Big and big. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's wrapped in my deucers. This is a big fish. Big perch. Big perch. Big perch. Got him. Yeah. 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 Yes. Yes. That is a freaking. I can't even grab him. That is a big old jumbo perch. Holy buckets. That's a big one. I'm going to run to my camera quick. Yes! Look at the size of that thing! That is a freaking mondo! That is a beautiful perch right there. Holy crap! I don't know uh, I don't know if we want to... I don't think... I don't, I don't know if we want to keep this. I don't want to keep this. This is a big, beautiful perch. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let this fish go. But that is... Holy crap, that's my first perch of the day. Wow, that is too cool. Too cool. I'm gonna let this guy go. Yes! That was freaking sick. I knew that was a big mark. That thing was just it, just, it just looked a lot different than all the bluegill marks I've been marking. Wow, that was really scary though. That freaking perch, it was all wrapped up in my deucer. I thought for sure it was going to come off. That was sick. That's a, my first perch of the day. Hopefully I can get a couple more of that size. Alright, I got some more spikes on the hook. Hopefully there's some more perch in this hole because that was it, that was so much fun. We have another really nice mark looking at me right now. It's, got him. I think it's a bluegill. It's a nice bluegill. Heck yeah, this is a good hole. That is a heck of a nice bluegill. Like what the heck? Take him right back. There's there's more fish just waiting for me. I just cut it. Nice perch. I know I saw that. Heck yeah. Nice work, homie. I saw you. And I was like, and then I also saw you release it and I went, uh, I was no, no, ask. choppy eating for me. Oh. I was gonna ask too and I. That's all right, man. I just did. Yeah. Well, this whole guy. On to the next. Oh. You fishing? I don't know if he is today. Oh, that's a good one. What is this? Need help? Oh, it's another perch. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> yeah. You want me to keep this one for you? For sure. I'll yeah. take a couple perch. Heck yeah. 
Nice, buddy. That is another one. Not quite as big as the last one, but still a quality yes. perch. Again. That's for the family. For the family. I'll take it. You know what we call that? Yeah. Perch McScrillage, my friend. Perch, Perch McScrillage. <laughs> Let's go. Well, this hole's kind of dying. I'm going to venture around just with my GoPro and uh, hopefully get on some more fish. Got him. Is it really a bluegill? It's just a really nice bluegill. Oh, no. I dropped him on accident. That is a really bright bluegill. Wow. Whatever. That's a nice one. So let him go, let him grow. Oh boy. We got a dip up. We got a dip up. I'll give you a second. So Sobe's down there. Okay. Man's going to get the camera. He's got a bite on the iFish Pro. Now I've never caught one on the iFish Pro. And I've never caught one using uh When you want to set I'm nervous, them, just Murray. I'm nervous, brother. Please. Flip the bail and send it. Do I breathe right now? What do you think it is? Bass? I'm going to go pike. Pike. Ready? Oh. Make it bass. Make it bass? Really? Yeah. I just seen it. Yeah. You can see it under the ice. Yeah. A little yeah. pike. Bass. Is it a bass? Yeah. Oh. Bass. Yeah. Nothing big, but uh, the boys are catching pike, Murray's catching perch, gills, and I'll catch a few bass. I caught myself a delicious bass. Get that guy back. Thanks, Murray. That's my first fish on the iFish Pro. So how do you like it? I, I love it. I love you know I love catching a fish on a rod versus a tip up. Hey, ready to get us dialed in, Murdoch? We'll get you a middle, and I'll let you do your thing. Can we set it up again? Well, of course. I'll set it up. Well, you know, I mean, I'll get a minute too. Out, I'll do both. Well, that was cool. That was a nice little bass. Let's get Mr. Hottie uh, another minnow. Gonna go with a big old, big old creek chub. These things are the juice out here. Oh boy, what do we have here? Gonna cream it. I know you guys love it when I say that. Gonna cream it. Oh, he's gonna cream it. Got him. Little boot. Whoa. Whoa. Look at that thing. That is weird. You can see it's gill. What the heck? The other side's fine. That's weird. Alright, dudes, welcome back to the big camera. We are, we're gonna put the fishing down for a little bit, and I believe Eric is gonna chef it up and cook us some delicious coho tacos. I've never had them before, and I'm super excited. So let's go in the shack and get this going. Fresh coho fillets, boys, from the Great Lakes, coming right at you. The day has been unreal. Eric is so kind, he invites us out here, puts us on the fish, cooks us grade A, Lunch? I don't know. I don't know what else to say. I'm excited. I'm awesome. I feel, feel happy to be here. You are. <laughs> I'm awesome. No, I said I feel awesome. <laughs> did I, I'm awesome. Did I say that? Yeah. No, I didn't. I said I feel awesome. <laughs> you said I'm awesome. No, I didn't. I'm awesome. I'm awesome. Sobe's so not as awesome as he seems. Okay. My lens is all messed up. Good. No, you can't use it. I'm using it. <laughs> Habanero. But look at the name of it. What's that say? Chip ma chick magnet? Chip chick magnet? magnet. <laughs> I, love I love to cook. You know, especially when you're out here with your buddies and stuff. Like, you know, when I was younger, like you guys, it was just all about the catching and just getting as many fish as fast as possible. Now that I get older, I come out here and you see I'm like one of the last guys to start fishing. I love seeing you guys catching them. And dude, I love cooking. I love, and I love cook. I love eating it, but I love cooking for people. It's just, it's awesome. When I'm on the ice, we do it all the time for our customers. We, we have time. Yeah. You like improvising when I when you don't have a knife? This scissors. So we'll cut this in strips, and this will be going on the fajitas later. We'll cook that in butter. 
it's a little bit of a process, you know, and it takes a little bit of extra time to get everything out here and, you know, if you're not even prepping it the day before, it takes time, you know, it's nice to have a little cooking station. But we just kind of winged it today. We got a hold of each other last minute and I ran to the store, grabbed some peppers, grabbed some cilantro, grabbed some stuff. <laughs> Man, if the boys are gonna come fishing today, we're gonna make it an epic day on the ice and an epic day eating. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I know what you're saying. Get the beans. All right, so who's gonna be the first victim? Brother. Thanks again so much, dude. Yeah, man, no oh problem. Yeah. The finished product is being delivered. <laughs> now, if you want a couple jalapenos, there's a couple oh. jalapenos down there, too. Yeah. Holy tits. Oh my god, dude. That was that was honestly the best supper, lunch, whatever I've ever had out on the ice. That was just freaking delicious huge shout out to Eric for cooking that up and just bringing us inviting us to come out here and fish and uh, yeah it was an awesome day if you guys could go down here like this video go share the crap out of this video go go smash that subscribe button and uh, where are we where are we going next Marv buddy I don't even know probably Door County we're going Door County yeah, we're going to okay well we have me Sobe and and Maverick have about a week of just we can do whatever we want so we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna bust out some epic videos for you guys and sounds like we're going to door county next so see you guys maybe tomorrow maybe the next day i don't know we'll see you then